This video is part of a research investigation into the effectiveness of danger point in teaching safety information over a long period of time. A purposive sampling method was used in order to create an accurate reflection of the accompanying quantitative data, which is available in the Danger Point 2016 research project. Semi-structured interviews were held with the children in order to gain an insight into their experience. I'd say 10 because um, it was really fun learning about, I never thought like learning about the dangers and everything could be really, really fun, but it's really fun it teaches you a lot and I'm glad I went there. Eight and a half because like, I liked the trains and the stuff to do with electricity and the fire and the uh, flood simulation and what would happen if a flood happened in your town. Mm, I think I should put ten because it's really fun and you get to do lots of things. And of course you get to talk with chaos and you and I think you've worked really hard to make danger point. I'd go for uh, 10 really fun because it was a very fun time. Um, with uh, Dan, um, do, uh, Dan, um, Paul, Jenna from Dan was a uh, pair of slide gardener, right on it. I have a choice on, um, I got a check at a can, Dan was a huge big and gashy dick with us for cheating and was cheating and bell or type ruin and aid in short but no good but charity the home part because like there's a lot of sections in that home part in different rooms and then you got to know a lot there but you also know that you had to um, testify along once a week and then there's like a little rhyme once pushing people once a week for me to remember that. Maybe like the Tom Fogan voice. Like, you, know, like you click the button and like you shoot the show how it's actually be flooded. And I like the beach part the best. It shown a lot more of the dangers that can happen at the beach since I go away a lot. The medal are lucky than that. I don't think so because I thought it was all quite interesting. Well, I didn't like um, the drugs part, and maybe I didn't like the um, that's it, you know the lifeboat thing. I'm describing it as weird, but funny kind of. Well, if I had a rate of te te uh, fit 100 to 0, I'd, ma I'd make it 100 out of 100%. Um, I like the chaos. It was funny when he said happy birthday to Izzy and Marcus. Really naughty but funny. Green, funny and an alien. <laughs> funny, weird and... Um, uh, um, 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 peculiar, peculiar. Yeah, because it's like you're learning in a fun way and people like to learn in a fun way instead of just learning. Um, he was really funny. Um, I remember quite a lot about him and he was really dangerous with all the stuff he did. So. Like it's a bit more fun for the kids because it's like an alien and it's not a human. Knowing how, uh, at like what height water can sweep people off their feet and like not to play with electricity and what to do with it in case of a fire. Yes, because I didn't know that um, it would take. 20, I think 20 football pitches for a train to stop at 125 miles per hour. Um, probably to not leave stuff on the radiator when we're going out and stuff.
probably still the same because it's still like a bit like scary when you're in the moment. I am more confident with it, but before that, I was like, I was not sure what to do. But now I'm more confident with it. I feel really confident because I learned like everything there. There's nothing they didn't teach you about the dangers, really. I'm like, I'm quite confident after visiting Danger Point because, like, now I know like how you can stop them and how like like the signs of like how they could come and everything. Um, how what I've learned and if I could uh, help you when if you get hurt or something. So yeah. I told them that it was like really, really fun and like hopefully we could go again one day. Uh, about what heights uh, the water can sweep you off the feet and what would happen during a flood and what would happen during the fires. Um I told them that if they had broken the charger you shouldn't leave it on the bed because it could have caused the fire. Um yeah, it was the um push and beep once a week one. Um but I die bag kai football came my train and stop here. Safety around trains. Fun, exciting, it's it's just amazing, everything looks realistic. It was really fun, interesting, um, and you got to learn a lot about it, which I thought was really fun. Fun, exciting, and sometimes a bit boring. <laughs> yes. Yes, because I thought that was really fun. Yes. Yes, because I probably learn a lot more things even though I've been there before. I was really hoil, I was really cute, 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 I was really cute,